What have you done? What? What's up, y'all? It's T-Tarn. Welcome back to the ending of this DLC. Yeah, we have beaten the game, but... Yo, we don't know anything that's happened. We don't know what Tropicus is. We don't know what the Parax Pokemon are. I think this game continues. So we're going to see. All right. Before I go on, y'all, make sure you shank that like button. Because look, I got Tropicus in my party. And we want to see what freaking type it is. What type is it going to be? Bro, they're gendering their legendaries now, man. They're, they're really taking their stuff more seriously. All right. What type could Tropicus be? Anyhow, by the way, when the last episode ended, Briar wanted to see me in her classroom. Yeah, I wonder if we can go to Karen's dorm now. What typing would Tropicus be, y'all? You know, he could be rock, psychic, water. That's the guesses. Normal type? Y'all, Tropicus is... Cr uh, wait, wait, wait. Where's Karen's dorm room? I'm gonna go to Carmine's dorm room. We'll check Tropicus's typing in here. I lied. I should have to be here for me to check it. All right, y'all. Listen. I have a... They have to answer what the frick the Paradox Pokemon Paradox and all is. There has to be more to this game. So we're going to figure that... God, I still... I didn't get to change my hair the entire time, huh? My prediction is, let's say, Rock Psychic for the base, Normal for when it transforms, and then 19th type for the biggest one. Where do you want to go? To Briar. Now, I love that ending of the game, y'all. Alright, what's good, Briar? Her theme. I love her theme. Man, we've been through some stuff together, you and me. I'm so happy Karen didn't die. Or disappear. Hey, Thamel. Glad to see you. Wait for her beat to drop. Wait for it. It's worth it. Trust me. You heard this. This is why I thought she was evil. <laughs> you feeling rested and recover? I'm so happy, bro. Are you feeling rested and recover after a big adventure in the Underdeps? No! Can you calm down? Really? Thought you'd be all chipper by now. You is on your side after all. But on to why I called you here. Since our return, I've been writing up. She's gonna make Keith's writing. She's gonna make everyone believe Heath's book. This is pivotal. I've been writing up everything we discovered on our expedition, and I have Tropicus to show. Honestly, I haven't even slept. I obtained Gita's permission and turned it all into a book. Wow, I guess it is Paul Dia. But don't worry, I've made sure to skip a few details and omit the names of those involved. <gasps> I'm gonna get a- Can you give me Heat's manuscripts? This might be how we learn what the Paradox Pokemon are. So voila. A proof copy of the book. Freshly delivered from a publisher just for you. The Briar's book? Yeah, what was that white book that uh, Toro and Sada got from some child? This DLC only brought more mysteries. Huh? Sorry. I don't know how loud that was. How? What the hell timing is that? Did Toro... Toro saw the future? Sada and Toro? Wow, you know, you got the Scarlet Book and Violet Book. Look, that's like the actual hidden shirt, the DLC book. The symbols. A proof copy of the exploration notes covering the areas or under depths. Oh my god, it's like a sequel to the Scarlet and Violet book. It's filled with long paragraphs describing what happened along with Briar's thoughts. I behaved recklessly in the under depths. I don't know what we would have done if it weren't for you. You truly deserve a copy of this book. I just hope it's sufficient as an apology. I love you. Uh, but there's something else I needed to check with you. Would you mind showing me your Terra Orb, Tamo? D what? I had it ready? <laughs> Something's happening to it? Hmm, I thought as much. It's behaving just like here in Carmine's Orbs. I think it might be because your orbs are directly exposed to super Terrapagus energy. Kieran and Carmine say that ever since the Underdips, they've been able to rationalize their Pokemon without Char- Oh, yo! We're super- We're super Saiyans now. We can infinitely use terrestrializing. Actually, there's one more piece of news I should share with you related to those deepest depths. You know the Terrarium- Yes, you put that there. You know the Terrarium core that hangs from the ceiling of the Terrarium? Well, until now. I've been keeping it topped up with a mixture of Paldian soil and water from the crystal pool in Kitakami. 
Hey, were you allowed to do that? Because you just got permission to kind of see the crystal pool. How does that make sense? That's how we've been able to stabilize the terrestrial phenomenon on our academy grounds. That's so peculiar. But the other day, I tried adding crystals I'd collected from the underlips of that mix, and it caused the properties of the core to change. The result? Pokemon shining and rip. She got the 19th type everywhere. That's cool. That's cool. Yo, so Kitakami is a big deal. It wasn't just some Isle of Armor side story. There's something to that crystal pool. Beyond it just being terrestrial crystals. Thanks to this, my research into the terrestrial phenomena is shining brighter than ever. So what? Guys, I'm just wondering, right? So does she go to the crystal pool after this? And then she runs into Sardan Toro and gives them the white book? But it was a child that gave it, not an older briar. White volume, y'all. It was a white book. Oh my goodness, what's going on? Oh, and there was one last thing. A man in a blue suit? I don't know a man in a blue suit. You wouldn't be talking about Cyrano. You know Cyrano. A man in a blue suit? Was looking for you by the academy the entrance? That's all I have to report for now. Thanks for setting aside from time to chat. I'm off to pay a visit to my publisher, so I'll leave you to it. Next time we meet, I'll ask you for a good long look at Teropagus. Damn. That must go in a different direction. Yo, what typing is Teropagus? That's pretty cool. So once you beat the game, you have infinite terrestrializing. By the way, guys, did you like did you realize Ogre Pond terrestrialized four times in a row? How how was she able to do that? Um, I don't care about you. I'm freaking. I'm. You, you want to know something? I'm shivering right now because I've had to lower the temperature in my house because I'm screaming so much. So now that I'm not screaming anymore, I'm shivering. I need stuff to get me to scream. I gotta warm up. You're not the man in blue. Who wears a blue suit? Uh, there you are, Tamil. Just the person I was looking for. I heard the news. You're the new BB League champion, am I right? Oh my god, it actually goes BBL. <laughs> Blueberry League. I'll admit it, I'm blown away. Inviting you to this academy was the best decision I've made until recently. So, now that you have some time to get comfortable here, how do you find Blueberry Academy? Are you having- I'm having a blast. But I'm gonna lie to him. So, so, eh? I'm sure you mean it. It's all so great, right? Anyway, there's a small favor I'd like to ask you. Can you cut my hair? You see, the whole academy has become so much more lively and energetic since you came here. It's since we saved Karen, dog. And that got me thinking. Maybe we should have even more people come visit from Paul. Oh, the clubhouse crap. Have them come as special guests and all. Yo, we need to get our hands on that hydrapple. You know a lot of people, right? You've got lots of friends and everything. I mean, like teachers from your school, gym leaders, that sort of thing. Oh, and strong friends of yours are also welcome here. Now, I don't want to do this, man. Don't you dare put this on me. Remember Lacey said he makes her do things? Wow, already thinking about who you can call, huh? What? That's not what my re response was. You can use the club room computer to contact anyone you want to invite, but it costs BP- Oh! Yeah, this is a fun system, then. Can you give me BP- I sh- Yeah, bro. If Penny didn't snitch on herself, I could have had her hack this crap. I think I'll arrange for the special coaches to stay in this club room when they're not teaching. Special coaches? Guys, who is someone in blue that we know? Larry decided to wear blue one? Gita wore blue? Oh my frick. Um, okay, and I like it. Oh my god, if it's Kofu, I swear if it's Kofu. Yeah, what is Tropicus is typing? I want to check so bad. Oh no, y'all, there's so many mysteries in this DLC. Like, what was up with that freaking indigo disc? What do you mean I can't use it? So what's the point of giving me this? What the hell? Hey, look, this sucker's not in the lead four. So, because the game ends with us in Blueberry, I guess... Our story as that Paldian champion is we just hang out in Blueberry after as the Blueberry champion. Yo champ, gotta thank you again for conquering the Blueberry League. All the tension here melted right away once we got our new champion. If I had my Drey Sturge routers, Karen and I'd be having fun battling again. What the heck is that? 
I thought we have patched things up right now, but I guess things ain't that simple. Nah, it'll work out, bro. You did- Yo, he poked the bear, though. He did. He, he went up to his ear and said, X champion. You know what to say, huh? Good quality in a reigning champion. Guess, it up, guess I ended up kind of using you to try and get what I wanted, huh, bud? But what you wanted was the drama to go away. I didn't mean to. I dropped the slacker life for once, and I just got carried away. Anyway, hope you'll accept my apology. Alright, I gotta change the the options. I gotta make this fast again so I can read. Okay, so I guess uh, we could see what these dudes want. Oh, they're... You seem to be fired up again, Crispin. Well, yeah, I had a big hearty meal and everything. Hee <laughs> hee, growing boys do eat a lot, don't they? You bet. We're always hungry all the time. What? Even after you eat? That makes no sense, silly. Oh, but what was it you wanted to talk to me about? Well, I'm eavesdropping, huh? Uh, alright. Well, I wanted to tell you, uh, see, maybe you and I could, you know... Are you kidding? So I'm not being an idiot, you know? I feel in the back of my head, you know, people thinking I'm weird because I'm suddenly seeing shipping. I'm not wrong! I'm happy this line exists. Now I can put my own ease at ease. There's freaking d shipping in Pokemon now, man. That's crazy. Yo. That, listen. I like it. I like it because it's gonna be official shipping, you know? It, it only gets weird when, like... Bro, when you see crap online, bro. It gets really weird. Um, okay. Uh, okay, I guess I'll check up on you. I wanna see the blue suit, man. I'm just trying to think of who it could be. Ooh, we also got Team Star and all. Damn, you just say Damo out loud? Damo. Yeah, my thanks for all you've done to help the league. I did help Kieran. Uh, once you became champion, Kieran withdrew himself from our ranking system. I guess it's... Though I consider this somewhat sad, it is not as if he and I no longer meet. More than anything, I'm glad he seems to be acting like his former self once more. Indeed, I've been swept up in joy to such an extent that I prepared a tremendous amount of flight-enabling supplements. Oh my god, I'm getting flight. It's not an Agaius. We got permaflight, guys. So this is weird, y'all. You know, there's a lot of mystery still in this game, right? I'm just not gonna say it out loud, but... Huh, you wanna fly now? Please slow down. The supplement was never meant to be eaten in such large... So this supplement has Herba Mystica crap to it. Unbelievable! I can fly! I would see your body just has flowered up somehow. From the looks of it, I would guess it gained the power to fly. Okay, let me out of here now. I am not doing your super hard thing. Oh my god, you fly the same way that it tortured me before. I don't understand. What are you getting by being this punctual? Your life's torturous. You got why you make yourself so miserable. Alright, we're gonna meet the blue suit, man. And then we're gonna check Trubagus' typing. Okay, I'm going to the entrance. You know what sucks? I can't even scream. My throat's freaking effed up. I don't see any blue suits. The Popo? There's no freaking way they called him. Cyrano, where's the blue suit man? Who even told me there was a blue suit man? Are there two Serranos in this game? Weren't you upstairs? 21, huh? I wonder who that one was. Teropagus? <laughs> I can't ride my ride on here? Are you serious, bro? Blue suit... Carmine? Okay. Okay, I regret freaking pushing that. Just when I think I have that mastered. What? Where's the blue suit, man? Don't make me have to do a freaking Like, exploring all over the- Why did she say- I'm gonna have to go meet Briar again. Maybe you? Congratulations on getting your BBL surgery. Oh, no. Oh, no. That is so sad. Snacks worth. I had so many ideas flowing in my head. Oh, would you look at the cut of the jib? You must be the one everyone's talking about. You're the Polly and Exchange student. Tamo. Or my name's not Snacksworth. Indeed, call me Snacksworth. Alright, I mean, he does give me some... Oh, see, I'm excited for the legendaries, actually, since they're standing around the region. So, he gives us snacks to find legendaries. So, alright, so tell me how this works. 
Alright, so I've completed 10 solo quests. I haven't. I got the bar. Oh, spec sheer tree. Okay. So now we can find spec sheer somewhere. You know, spec sheer? Frightfully rare, that one. What are you talking about? It's a legendary. I do recall this one particular encounter when I was a young feller. Is this guy. A ghost or something? He's gonna have stories for every legendary? I was off hiking among Paldia's peaks for a bit of fun. Mountain climbing being a bit of a hobby. I was taking my sweet time meandering up some mountain paths dotted sparsely with trees. I came upon this old ruin on the path covered in vines and I thought to myself, now doesn't that seem a good a place as to I need to take a rest? I no sooner drawn close for a look than this black shadow of a Pokemon appeared. Spectre had been sleeping inside. It popped its long face out and scared the spirit out of me. He so he saw it in like a bit uh, a structure. Yeah, your story was way too long for me to tell what he just said. How many? So do I have to fill this whole crap up again to get another snack? You're kidding me! You know how long that's gonna take? All right. You know what? Let's check Trubagus's typing. Yeah, I don't want to... Oh, I do need to hear the tale again. Right, let me write this down. Old ruin covered in vines. And I thought to myself, now doesn't that seem like a good place as I need to take a rest? All right. So, it's on a mountain near trees. And then there's an old ruin near there covered in vines. I, I kind of want to check it out. All right. But first, I'm going to do this. My ultimate guess is Rock Psychic. I can't believe it. I'm about to see Turbo because just typing. I still can't believe they made it a boy. They it's a normal type! <laughs> Terra type Stella! Unbelievable! We have a 19th type in Pokemon. Wow, it has. I guess Terra uh, uh, Star Storm is like a super Terra Blast. With the power of its crystals, the user bombards and eliminates the. Eliminates. When used by Trubagus in its stellar form? Trubagus, Terrasto form, stellar form. Wait, I can use it? Isn't it gonna break out of the ball? Terra Shift. When the Pokemon enters battle, it absorbs the energy around itself and transforms. Oh, so you can never fight with this form. Unbelievable. Level 85. Well, we got a new addition to the team. I'll put you in the front. Can you... Can I send it out? I can't send it out. Oh, man. I I'm just gonna give this a quick check, y'all. I'm gonna see if I can find this picture. I can't look anything up online, of course. So I'm gonna try to find this up myself. So up mountains, there was a ruin. A, a set of ruins. Fairy cruise bait. Wait. Hey. Here we go. Here's a place with trees. Maybe it's like right here. I'm gonna check this place. Um, I have no flying spot, bruh. I'm just gonna give it a quick check, y'all. Just so we feel organized about our situation. Yo, we got three regions in one Pokemon game. Unbelievable. This is wild. Oh, I forgot I can fly. Alright, this is really tough, dude. He does not give many examples. I mean, he... Where am I? I don't remember this part of the game. Wait! Are you kidding me? This is amazing! You can actually find them! A place by the mountains where there's sparsely trees at ruins! This is a legit treasure hunt! Yo! We got static legendaries again! Alright, you know what? Let's test out Terrapagus right now. I'm a quick ball at first. It's gonna have its theme. Oh, y'all, 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 y'all. It's it's not like in Sword and Shield. It's at no. It's at oh y'all scared of Spectre? No. It's actually standing. You have to push A. I didn't think I would be freaking gas for stuff. 
what's my typing now? I'm so small. They did not tell me Tropicus was this small. They made it look ginormous. Guys, let me get to Spectre here. Cutscene? Oh, Game Freak. Game Freak, man. I am so freaking happy. Yes. Let me see my typing. Oh, I'm normal. It's so weird. We have a normal type legendary, y'all. All right, let's see if we can do this. Yeah, Tropic is broke. This is such a breath of fresh view. Yo, Tarbicus broke out of the master. I'm gonna end up killing it. I have to see what this ability does. I I resist normal. I have to, I have to see what this does. Hold up. Terra Shell. The Pokemon Shell contains the power of each type. All damage dealing moves that are hit. That hit the Pokemon when its HP is full will be not very effective. Yo, we predicted this. It's a super multi scale. We predicted this perfectly. That's pretty badass. All right. I can paralyze you, and then I'm gonna try to catch you. Wait, it's confused? It confused itself because of Thrash! I was freaking enjoying myself. There's no shot. How am I gonna catch it? Wait, it is nighttime. Do I have dust balls? I absolutely do. Not. I don't know how this is gonna go in. I have to do this all again? Bless you. No, wait. Why do you have these moves? Do I have a ghost type? I'm so screwed. Please go in this ball. <laughs> Why? Confusing moves and jab Rico moves. Please do it. You know you can do it. Okay, I've died. Okay, I have like one or two turns to catch it now because it's gonna confuse itself. Y'all, that was such a vibe. Wait, it, does, it has no Pokedex entry. Y'all, that's a vibe. I cannot believe it. First off, it has its theme. But second, that treasure hunt vibe worked out to find the legendary like that. All right, let's go back to Snacksworth. Wow, he doesn't care. I'm going to do some blueberry quests and get my, my bar filled up. Then I'll come back to him. All right, I've just done a bunch of these quests. Check this out, right? So if I kill 30 Pokemon using auto battle, you know, I start, I get a huge bonus. I think I've done like 20 quests, y'all. So we can talk to Snacks where it's after this. I just need to complete this bit right here. And then also, guys, we have to go to the Blueberry Clubhouse because we can invite people, right? If we can figure out how to invite Kieran or we figure out where even Kieran went right now. Can you not run after me? Yo, by the way, these quests are getting harder the more you do. Look at this. Make a sandwich that uses three ingredients. That's my first time seeing that one. All right. How many are we at? Are we done? Where? Oh, it's already done. I have a thousand now. All right. Don't come near me. So we're going to fly back to Snacksworth. All right. But since I have a thousand, yo, that should be a huge amount. I should be able to invite anyone with that. That was like 20 quests. All right. So we're gonna go here and hear some stories from Snacksworth. I wonder if it's random, the legendaries he gives you, or if... I mean, I'm gonna get Glastrier next. I guess Glastrier would be in the opposite version. Oh, shoot. Alright. You've completed 20. Alright. <laughs> okay! Damn, bro! Alright, I gotta write this down. Frightful Rare. I don't know why he says that. Speaking of Zarkram, I do recall this. Okay. 
Mesa... Okay, I set up from Mesa Goza. It's very weird they chose to add in the Unova Legendaries, y'all. All right, we're gonna quickly check out the clubhouse. I mean, come on, Unova sounds like it's next. Way to do that. Way to put them right here. League club room. Yeah, where is, uh, where's Kieran? I have a feeling we can go back down to area zero, y'all, and something might happen. Because remember that one place that was blocked off? Yeah, where'd the computer go? Okay. Let's see what this crap here is about. Uh, call a special coach. Oh my god, do you have to call these dudes? Don't do this to me. Let's get Ayono. Two freaking hundred. Let's just get these out of the way. I guess we have to call a bunch of these. Alright, we might get Laura. Let's see. Mayono, are you Miriam's mom somehow? Don't look at me, alright? If you miss some of my videos, that's not my theory. Nor do I think it at all. It's a joke. Hello? Is she here? Oh my god, she's here! It's Damo. Thanks for requesting this collab. <laughs> Let me hit you with the eyeball snatching title I brainstormed for my next stream. Gym leader Ayono infiltrate Yo! How caps this weird academy? You won't believe what she finds. Um, now we just need the weird unbelievables. Yo! This is what YouTubers do, bro. They make the title first. Uh, what do you, should we focus on? Um, the Blueberry League. Because I want to know where Kieran went. The kiddos here formed their own little Pokemon League. That's weirdly uptight, but neato. I'll do some digging around. Thanks for the tip. Alright, so now, now we can, like, trade and crap. Want to do a battle in? You know what? I'm interested. I'm just going to do this battle real quick. Let's get... Stop talking. Let's get someone important in the front, like Teropagus. Alright, let's do this. So, we'll get a feel for how these, uh, these coaches work. Where are we going to battle anyway? The center stadium? Darn! And she got her team! Okay! Yo! Remember how we don't have a league for rematches? We kind of- we have gym leader rematches now. This is weird, y'all. I can't believe- yo, they did Tropicus very interestingly in this game, you know? It's just weird that we can catch it. Oh my god! How does this even work, Stella? I have to- we have to do it- wait a second, am I allowed to do this? kidding me? Okay, we just can't terrestrialize it in Area Zero, I guess. In the center of all its crystals. Are you kidding me? We can use this Chaos Pokemon? By the way, let's look at its Pokedex entry. Yes! Let's look at its Pokedex entry. Yeah, I'm, I'm a little mad. We can't read Briar's book? What's up with that? Okay, I, I, I feel like I can just sweep her whole team like this. Should I just sweep her team off screen? Um, let's see. Are you? That is the most disrespectful crap, man. Wait, these guys have competitive teams potentially. As hard as the blueberry. Wow. Yo, Game Freak. That's crazy. What the hell is Super Slam Sale Al? Super Slam Slam? How many new moves are in this game? Bro, I can't beat her. <laughs> These guys are really strong. They all have trainer red level teams. This is hard. This is some wild stuff. Maybe Ogre Punk can sweep them, actually. Yo, look at that icon for Tropicus. Dude, that, it's so massive. I don't even know. Oh. Tra Terraform Zero. That's the third ability. When Tropicus changes into its stellar form. It uses its hidden powers to eliminate all effects of weather and terrain, reducing them to zero. Oh! Oh my god! So it counters the two Paradox Kings. This is very weird. Bro, this is very weird. We gave it an ability to counter the two. Oh, she still has her Vela Bolt. Okay. So someone activated Ogre Punch Defiance, so now she can sweep everyone. Okay, except this Vela Bolt, I guess. That's very nice. So I guess maybe you beat each coach and then you can trade with them. Yo, there's a lot of post-game content then. All these legendaries to catch, all these gym leader rematches with new teams. 
Miss Maggie is okay. Here's her her same Terrasto. My view count on the rise like super fast electros calling out of the ocean. That was a weird thing, I don't know. I've never heard I've never thought of that before. An eel climbing out of the ocean? Come for it, shiny little light bulb. No one buzzes as super duper bright as you. I'm assuming, y'all, there must be like I just don't know how to trigger it. Like, are we just not gonna talk about the Paradox Pokemon? No. There must be, right? Because we have the legendaries to deal with. I think if we go back down to Area Zero, Brian might be sneaking around there. I'm gonna try it out. Nice. Same theme and everything. You, you smack. Tell me who you are. She could be unrelated to Miriam, honestly. Oh man, I lost that, that, that. But look at those viewer numbers. This is beta sweet. Wait, did I? Did my loyal fans just see how I'd react to losing to a champion? Oh! <laughs> hey, yo, the viewers don't have your best intentions in mind. <laughs> She's, uh. What the hell? She's speaking facts. Okay, um. Okay, let's just... Let's see who else we can invite. What the hell? What, how do you unlock these? What? The secret boss of... The one who summons the greatest number of guest coaches to our fine house of learning using BP will learn... Oh, it's locked. What is this crap? What is actually 3,000? How much post-game content do you th Oh, hell no. I don't even understand who... Blueberry Academy. Wh who would it be? Someone from Unova? Y'all. What do you got me doing out here? I just want to find Kieran. All right, you know what? Let's invite another guest. I'm assuming we have to call all these dudes. But I don't think I'd have to beat them, right? Wait, since I beat Iono, let's see if I get the trade now. Oh, okay. Okay, I I'm hoping I don't have to fight all of them, though. Alright, so, uh, call a special coach. Let's get these out of the way. Let's get, uh, Larry. See what he says. I ain't fighting you. He's gonna be so pissed at me. Hello, I'm here on behalf of Paldea Region's Pokemon League. It's a pleasure doing business with you. Why is this man like this? Come on. Let me go. Larry. Oh, they all stay. What? Yo, Larry, how come you don't face the camera in your gym leader pick? I prefer to keep y'all y'all game free. If people knew my face, I'd run into the risk of drawing crowds that make it hard to get into restaurants, or worse, I could get banned for causing a disturbance in one. Hold on, hold up, hold up. You don't want Did I just pick two people who would react to each other? Or this is this is how this thing just works. Wait, that's not even the bonkiest part. How'd you get the okay to do yours different? <laughs> Everyone else has a regular pick. Okay, it's cause he he knows Gita. I guess? Gita sounds stern though. Oh, it's you. Call me out to another region. Is a certain chairwoman rubbing off on you? <laughs> Actually, don't worry about it. To be honest, I don't mind these little business trips. Uh, uh oh! I heard that Unova has two particularly famous dishes. Berry sandwiches and Castilia cones. Okay, Castilia cones. I see. I suppose you must have a sweet tooth. Thanks for the input. Alright, let's get another guest! I'm really hoping we don't have to fight them. It feels like you don't have to. Let's grab... Who would make a good... Oh, Kofu, because he cooks. Darn, we're gonna have this place filled with everyone. Oh my god, it took away Iono. So it replaces him. So you can get all of these dudes to interact. Larry, just the food you want to see. Okay, this is what we saw in the trailer. So I guess what we could do is pair up Miriam with Iono. Then we're forced to hear it. Right? Okay, we gotta keep... How do you get the rest of these? I don't want to use my blooper. I just work so hard to get these. I don't want to. 
You're kidding me! I have to re-invite her? Alright, I guess what? That ain't happening, bro. I have no idea what's going on there. You know what we're gonna do, guys? We're gonna mess around. I think all this... <laughs> this might be... Uh, bro, this might be off-screen fun, man. This might be just stuff I can do off-screen for fun. I don't know if this is stuff to make a video about, but... I'm gonna mess around. I'm gonna try to explore around. You know? Yeah, I tried. If it would have stacked everyone in that room, I would have kept going. See, I want to go back to the Great Crater. But I guess another thing we can try to do is go to the Crystal Pool. So, yeah. This Crystal Pool, y'all. Toro and Sada somehow traveled to here. Either a vision or actually... And they got a book? Look, look, long ago. Long ago, not recently. Not like when Sada and Tora had their vision. Long ago, the crystal pool was infused with crystalline material from an unknown source. Its water is a faint glow, but it's safe to drink and even serves as the village's water source. Tales say that gazing upon the glowing water can allow you to meet those who have passed on. What? This makes no sense, dude. Wait, Tropic- Tropicus! Tower to me! What's happening here? What have you done? What? What? Hello? Are you serious? Look at the way he's moving. Is that the human? The sucker knows every secret in the unit. Right, I'm warmed up now. I'm not cold anymore. Am I recording? This is insanity. Oh my god. But I don't even know you to see you. That means I'm actually... Am I gonna give him the Briar Book? Don't even play. Don't even play. Don't even play. You gotta chill. I'm a child. Am I white? I'm wearing white. Well, no. Oh my god. This is the real Toro, guys. He was... This is a curious development. Have I somehow broken through the boundaries of space-time? Y'all, what? And who are you? Look, they put the question mark. I don't even know. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what to ask him. Are you the AI? What's that? He's, he's freaking... <laughs> What's that? You say you thought I was some robot inf imbued with an AI personality? Oh my god, the time loop happened! I told y'all they'd make paradoxes! He hasn't even made the AI yet! Yo, this is 10 years ago maybe, before he even made the Terra Orb. I'm the one who gave him the idea. I told y'all, it's a time loop. Yes! Hmm, now that's an idea. If I could create such a thing, it'd be quite useful. Are you kidding me? I am Professor Turo. I research Pokemon in Area Zero. Y'all, am I dreaming? What? He's never pulled one out yet! The freaking time loop, bro. The paradox! Th this Pokemon, is this the Iron Serpent? From the, uh, from the Vala book he read as a kid. 
Do not tell me I'm the one who named Maridon. Don't do it. Don't freaking do it, bro. Is that right? So its name is Maridon. No freaking way. We named it, guys. When he writes in his journal, I've de I've decided to name it Maridon. Or she writes Karidon. It's because she saw this vision. I told y'all. There's paradoxes in this game. Yo, but time travel is real then. So I don't even know if they're dream Pokemon now. Hmm, that's a good name. Again? From the clues you've already let slip, I suppose I would have to conclude. What would Sada say? It's weird to hear Sada saying this from my perspective. This must be the future? Of course, the complexities of space-time are beyond count. Y'all, y'all, I love this. Do you know what this means? Tropicus is a time travel Pokemon, just like the Orano Shimoku story. Frick. Yeah, it's a time travel, but it's not a freaking dream Pokemon. Maybe it is a dream Pokemon, but it has time travel abilities. It actually sent Toro to the future. Though, of course, the complexities of space-time are beyond count. It's possible that our encounter might not even be occurring in a timeline connected to my own. Okay, they threw that in there just to confuse us. <laughs> Perhaps this meeting is nothing more than a fleeting miracle. Why don't we exchange as much useful data as we can in what little time that fate has gifted us? I take the white book. Of course this would happen, y'all. A freaking course. Um, sir? I can't save the game! This is insane, guys. Um, um, we might learn what the frick is happening. Maybe he can give us enough clues to figure out what the Paradox Pokemon are. Please let me ask all three. Maybe I can learn about your baby mommy. What if he says, <laughs> her name was Sada, she left me a long time ago. What? Why are you here? I don't precisely know the cause. I was analyzing some recent data in my secret lab one moment, and the next, I was standing here before you. Perhaps this is the influence of the crystal Pokemon that lies dormant in that place. I have it. Or perhaps the cause lies with you and I. I don't know what that could mean, but also Teropagus is what summoned him here. So Teropagus... Do you need Tropicus to see people or it just activated it like a cheat code? What, what are you studying now? Okay, you know what's happening? He thinks this is like an... I'm just, he thinks he's hallucinating or something. So he's just indulging in it. That's why he said it might not be connected to our timeline or anything. Sucker, it's more than likely is. Uh, I am researching methods to catch Pokemon that live in different timelines, so I might transport them to the present day in my own timeline. It sounds fantastical, no doubt, but I'm drafting plans now for a machine that may achieve it. Give me that book so I can open the time machine right now. You see, this book captured my imagination when I read it as a child and has never let go. Look, he finally says it. But progress has been slow and beset by failures. I haven't left my lab in quite some time now. I desperately hope that I might glean some new insight from this conversation so I can finally make some progress and return home. He wants to go home to Arvin. Here we go. What about your family? Yeah, I'm so freaking happy this just happened. 
Oh, you even wish to know about my private life? He smiles. I do have a family. A son. He is probably at home right now. Well, no, I suppose right now could be inaccurate. Whenever and wherever he is, I imagine he must be quite lonely. Oh, he's gonna ask me some questions? Yes! Now, let us trade places in this exchange. I'd say the time has come for my own questions. What is this place? It doesn't appear to be anywhere in Paldia. This is the crystal pool. He knows? So where I kid a coming crystal pool, eh? I remember reading about it in certain texts. It said that. It's said to be a place where water wells up from the ground imbued with terrestrial energy. Darn! It would seem that I've been shifted quite far in both space and time. Keep them coming, bro. At least, okay, my next question then. That Pokemon you have. Y'all! Y'all! This is the key to how he figures out how to make the time machine work. That means the Pokemon you have, the Iron Serpent, I mean Muridon. Tell me more about it. None of these are helpful. I found a collapsed on a beach. Did you really? Then I wonder whence it came and how it happened to arrive at that beach. You know what's crazy? He dies protecting this very Muridon from the bully. And then shortly after, I imagine they fight again and then it loses and it runs away. Then I wonder whence it came and how it happened to arrive at that beach. Though it appears you don't know much about the creature's exact origins yourself. Like, yeah? I can't believe this is happening right now. Hmm, that book you have there. I don't recognize its cover. What is it? The hidden treasure of Area Zero? You can't read this! W would you let me see it for a moment? Oh my god! He's gonna get sent back! <laughs> Descriptions of the Area Zero Underdepths? And a record of Teropagus' awakening? Who is this prior to have written such a work? His secret lab is the Underdepths, right? Or is his secret lab that time machine one? Are you telling me he's gonna... If it isn't the Underdepths, he's gonna learn how to get to the Underdepths because of this? She's a descendant of heat. I gotta tell him. Now, isn't that amazing? A descendant of the author of the original Violet book. Exploration runs in the family, I see. At any rate, that is a book that would ignite the imagination of any true scientist. I'm sorry, but I simply must have the time to read this book more thoroughly. No! Don't go away! Take it, take it. Ah, the mist is closing once again. I sure that means our time is near 10. Yo, bro, guys! I freaking predicted this, yo. Yo, you gotta give me credit. My whack-ass ideas. Remember I said, right? But I said this for heat. But, because when they said you can see people who have died, they never said you can pull them from space-time. But I just threw the idea anyway, that maybe we could summon heat from... Wait, this idea can still be true. I said maybe you can summon heat from his time period 200 years ago to witness the Kieran crap happen. And so that picture of Chaos Tropius is actually what Kieran did. And you can pull people from space-time. I assume that means our time is near its end. Oh, Maridan's gonna miss him. I wish I could spend longer getting to know the Iron Serpent, but I must hurry. That book, I imagine it might be quite valuable. It wouldn't be right for me to claim it without offering you any recompense. Ah, an exchange? An exchange then. Do I hate to pay?
heart with some. That makes no sense. Though I hate to part with something so precious to me. That's what I'm talking about. That makes no sense. How? The Violet Book exists in the current timeline. And then your AI takes it to the future. I get his key? We can unlock the time machine with this. I'm not saying no. Just I don't even care. I have to say yes. Yo, it's a real time machine. I can't believe this. I have the key to the time machine. Bruh, it's a paradox. It's a paradox that makes no sense. Because he did get this from the white child, which is me. That part does happen. But it's like a different timeline? Because that book does... It, Now, nah, we're in a time loop. There's multiple violet books that have the key in circulation. Something like that. Um, I appreciate this more than you can imagine. Perhaps I should take this chance to go home and enjoy a bit of downtime with the good book. This is where we part, fellow adventurer and Iron Serpent. How lucky we were to meet across space and time. Don't you freaking say that! Yo, my heart. Why would this happen to me? Yo, Game Freak, man. My one dream in this. I don't care about the Kieran old man thing. All I wanted was one paradox. Confirmed. So everyone knew I wasn't crazy. What did I what it's saving the game? Did I just do something to the timeline? Why did it turn white? I think it's just loading. Huh? What? Did I just broke time. Oh, what the hell is happening? It I yo guys, that means we're in the same timeline. We just did something to time. <laughs> 